How's it going? It's Elena coming to you from a car. I haven't done that in uh, quite some time. I'm back in California and I am so excited because I'm about to go camping in the Sequoias. I camped in the Sequoias a few times in college and I have not been back in multiple years now. So I'm so excited. I'm also like a camping novice. Like I never grew up camping and I always had friends that knew how to camp. This is my first time like taking the charge and like figuring it out for myself. My friend Gabby, who you may have seen in other videos, she is back in California as well. She had a like photography job that brought her out here. We're gonna meet up and we're gonna go camping in the Sequoias for several days. We're staying in Lodge Pool, which I guess technically is in Kings Canyon National Park, but it's like attached to Sequoia National Park. So we're gonna be exploring that region. I just cannot wait to get back out into nature. I miss it. I love being able to just like disconnect to nature, like no surface, just you and the trees and the fresh air. So I have a nice long road trip ahead of me, about five hours of driving. Gonna pick up Gabby and then be on our way. Also, for any of you out there who have left a comment asking where I found my music, what music I edit to, I pretty much always edit to Epidemic Sound, who is the sponsor of today's video, which is so exciting. I've used them for years, literally, like every day while editing. So if you don't know what Epidemic Sound is, it's basically a platform that has a bunch of different copyright free music with different type of licenses available. They have over like 35,000 tracks as well as 90,000 sound effects that are all super high quality, professionally made. You can kind of find different music by looking through different moods, genres, albums, kind of like whatever you're looking for, it's there. They have a super helpful discovery feature that basically helps you search and filter through different songs to find the right song for you. And they release new tracks every single week, which is awesome. I can rest easy knowing that I can monetize all my music completely hassle-free, worry-free. Otherwise, it's pain in the ass for YouTubers to try to find music. They have like personal plans if you're looking for music for, you know, a podcast or if you're a YouTuber and then they have more commercial plans with different licensing options depending on what your needs are. Also, if you want to check it out, they have like a 30-day trial period that's completely free to see if it's a good fit for your copyright-free music needs. You can sign up for free, cancel your subscription at any time if it's not the vibe for you. Also, you can use the code Elena Tabor for an additional month free after the 30 day free trial period for the personal plan. So definitely check that out down below. I'm a huge fan of Epidemic Sound. And on that note, it's time for me to hit the road for a nice five hour drive. I'll see you guys in the Sequoias. Let's go. Such a short time. Lodgepole Campground. We just checked in. Look at it. Oh my God, look at all it is. This is my home. Should we set up the tent first? Let's, okay. let's do that first. Yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Two camping novices, honestly. I mean, I've camped a lot in my life, but I've always camped with people who like know how to camp. Like me and Gabby go figure it out though. Oh my God, I'm literally not even happy. <laughs> <laughs> this is like it. the cutest little campground. Oh. Got our little bear locker. Also, this is the first time in my life I've ever gotten acrylics and I feel like such an imposter being in the woods with these nails. Okay, she's looking a little saggy, but that's okay. <laughs> And that'll be beautiful because we'll probably get to like the peak around when golden, golden hour, hour. Kind of starts. But still have enough light to like come home. <laughs> First trail of the day. Let's do it. Just set up our cute little campsite. A very impromptu trip, but we are so excited to be outside. Kind of feel on top of the world. Neither of us know how to make a fire, so stay tuned for the adventures. <laughs> and the market was closed, so we couldn't get like fire starter or the matches. So we, fire we actually at all. have no light source. No. So we're planning for a night of dark. Yeah. Yeah. Don't have matches to start a fire. No matches. I feel like I've seen enough friends start a fire that I could do it safely. But alas, we're gonna make some friends. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Thank 
time. Hello. From our hike, we just did the um, Topaka Falls. I'm probably yeah, something like that. I think so, that might have been wrong. But. Yeah, it sounded wrong. <laughs> it didn't sound right. Absolutely stunning. It was only two miles in, now two miles back. We stayed until sunset, so we're kind of like scurrying back because we're like, well, don't want to get trapped in the woods at night. We were joking that it literally looks like, <laughs> this is going to sound very city, city girl of us. We're on elliptical, but they have the little screen displays. We've been through here virtually. Virtually before. On exactly. Trail, but never. Yeah, exactly. I'm like, oh my God, it's happening. It's, it's in real life. And the air's so clean. And then we're going to hopefully figure out how to make a campfire when we get back. We might ask our neighbors for help. Stay tuned. <laughs> we'll definitely. We we'll definitely. We'll ask definitely will. Help. <laughs> Guys, this woman literally has wolves. Straight up wolves. This segment we call Alana and Gabby try to start a fire. Try and start a fire, we but I'm feeling overly confident. No, we had to uh, borrow this from a random man. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I mean, I mean we're gonna make it work because if we can't do it, he'll we're help doomed. us. Okay, true. <laughs> <laughs> uh, anybody out there? This is so funny. Right, my journal. Light's valuable journal of Viara, for the record. But all I know about <laughs> is from watching friends do it in college. Okay. I literally have never done this in my life. Not a great start. Sticks on fire. <laughs> so the, so the, the, the toilet paper is burning wonderfully. The sticks, not so much. Oh, that's a great idea. <laughs> it's fine. It's not gonna catch. Oh, well, it will. Okay, okay. Oh my god, it will. <laughs> Wait, this literally like, doesn't. Look I mean, the wood's not on fire. It's just it's the toilet wheel. paper. It's a lie. <laughs> it's too funny. Please. <laughs> You made the introduction before, and then I'll be here like trying, and he'll be like, let me come in and help you. He will be more kind of. He's kind of like stoked that we were saying. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. This is so funny. What do we do? I think we need to ask him for help. Should I just be like, just be like, hey. Just like, gonna hey, follow-up question. Yeah, like, she's gonna I do it. I have to do it alone? You can't be like, I mean, I can come with. I, yeah. But I'm just okay. worried this all <laughs> gets on fire. Oh, you no. think that's exactly what we want? <laughs> Update. Camping's <Invite> hard. Yeah. <laughs> Help. We're just swimming dinner. I'm just gonna Google this. The kind man also gave us fire starters, so we're gonna light this up. Let's do it. <laughs> Put underneath. it right in the middle, yeah. But like underneath the Kindle? Yeah. Those if this doesn't, that's so embarrassing. Well, I think the homie just saved our lives. Random man living out of your car. You saved us. Is this even a good tactic? Do you fan the flame? Good morning. Slept decently well last night, all things considered. Woke up a lot because it was cold and now <laughs> got the morning voice. <laughs> but it's beautiful out. We're coming up with our game plan. Here we are, Sequoia Kings Canyon. So. There's this really helpful app called All Trails that we did not think to download before we left. All Trails is great for looking up trails, but you need service obviously to find said trails. So we are at Lodgepole Visitor Center today in the Sequoia National Park, and I think we're gonna take the road up to Kings Canyon and maybe do a nice eight or nine mile hike here. Yesterday we did this really pretty Tacopa Falls hike. We'll see where the day takes us. Us. We're back. So, update. We did find that the Kings Canyon Lodge was open. Got some great advice. And she sent us on our way, the local ranger, to a hike that's another hour drive. So, <laughs> lots of car time these days. But she said it was like well worth going to yeah. these falls. Even yeah, though falls. it was a long, long drive, it was like it's a must do. How are you feeling? Me I'm too. feeling good. Me too. I'm very ready to get out of the car. I'm ready for I'm a nice ready long to walk. Hike. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be like a nice like nine mile hike just to like yeah. be nice and tired after. Yeah, yeah. So let's go. Up. 
day. We are about two miles in to our nine mile hike towards Miss Falls. We just stopped at this gorgeous creek behind us. And we're about to start going uphill. I didn't look up any photos or anything before, so I don't really know what I'm getting myself into, but I feel like it's gonna be stunning. Stay tuned. Maybe out there trying to do this hike. The first like three miles are gorgeous and pretty chill. But let me tell you, the last mile, straight uphill. The whole way. Twist and turn, so it's very deceiving. You feel like you're gonna be there and you're like, oh I can finally like get some water and a snack. Nope. Just keep going. Uh, it really is misty. We made it to Mist Falls. Here she is in all of her glory. We accidentally like bypassed it somehow. Ended up walking a mile fully up the mountain. And so I think we accidentally in total will have walked like 11 mile hike, but that's okay. It's stunning. The sequoias are unreal. I can't believe I'm here. I can't believe I was just in New York a bit ago. Here, the juxtaposition is insane. Like I, it looks like I'm in a fairy tale. back at the campsite. Got the fire up this time in like three minutes. Feeling so proud, making some rice. Easy to make little doll packages. That's gonna be a bomb dinner. So we're both exhausted, but feeling accomplished. I think I'm gonna do a little journaling, gonna read. We're gonna play some cards. It's gonna be a cute, it's gonna be a cute night. Good morning. Got Gabby over here. <laughs> <laughs> Making a little rat. We're going on a hike today in Sequoia National Park. Yesterday we did Kings Canyon, so today Sequoia. We're literally at the parking area for like Morrow Rock, if you've heard of it. But we're gonna like put together some different little hiking trails to get like a nice like six or seven mile hike in and get our, our body moving. A little um, trunk. Canyon. Right, a little rough, but we make do. We've got the cucumber, the hummus, the avocado. Honestly, <laughs> Honestly it looks good. It, looks it does look good. Moment of truth. <laughs> Can she do it? Can she actually do it? I love that it's like our table's a little croy box <laughs> with like a dirty pan inside. <laughs> of trails so we did like sugar, sugar pine, pine to to meadow crescent meadow crescent meadow to thorpe's log now we're on huckleberry meadow road so and we're just having the best time yeah this is a master in sequoia oh my like so incredible 
and in general, just go, go on a hike. Clear your head. The amount of clarity we've had and like beautiful conversations and space to think in a way that I haven't in months is like just so necessary. Yeah, it's been amazing. Oh my goodness. See the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Seven so miles later, and we made it to Morro Brook. Today we did seven miles. Yesterday we did 11. That was but a little bit more to see before we wrap up the trip. Top of Morro Rock. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, big few days of walking. Right? Maybe wow. don't walk seven miles before walking at Morro Rock. Yeah. It's a bit longer than we expected. Yeah. But the views yeah. are incredible. Oh, we don't need no Thanks again for watching and don't forget to check out Epidemic Sound. And you can use my discount code Aletta Tabor for an additional month free. Oh,